Good morning, it's Trixie. So I'm going to do the rest of the Timu stuff today. I think there was two deliveries. Um, and then I can get it put it away because I just need all this stuff put away now. <laughs> I'm just like, oh, I'm so cluttered everywhere. Um, yeah, I've got a couple more orders coming, but some of this stuff is going to be for the kids' party as well. So I need to sort it anyway. So I'm going to make this video now possibly won't upload it but at least if I make the video then I can put everything away so there was one thing off the other order that I did do the other day which was a blanket um it's 200 centimeters by 150 and it was 16 pounds but I got it for pretty much for free because I had um, a lightning deal thing and it said if I bought it and then I had like a Kind of a coupon thing so what i've noticed with the coupons if you send things back uh return and you've used coupon to buy it they will only give you the money back that you paid for it so say you got six seven quid off it because it, you had a coupon you don't get the full amount back so bear that in mind when you return anyway because i got the um lots of money off this i went for the bigger size it's just a big 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 fleecy blanket um it's white on that side but their blankets are really really soft their throws um and it's a huge this is two meters by as i said uh whatever i said to you just now basically one and a half by two meters so really really big um and i just went for the floral one it's going to go in my lounge but yeah so i wouldn't have bought that for 16 pounds although it's definitely worth 16 pounds because it's huge but i i got it on a like I said, on a voucher deal thing. So that's why I bought that one. So, um, right, let's get stuck into this. I'm going to do all three of these. It's not massive of stuff, but... Um, just check which one this is. So, firstly, I got another one of these, which I've had before. Um, they call it Dragon's Blood. It's obviously not Dragon's Blood. It was £2.48 and I get 23p off it on a price adjustment. I'm going to open it to show you because I can't see where my other one is right now. It's nearly run out. Um, it's all sticking to me. So it comes in a box. This looks slightly different to the one that I've had before. The pot's bigger. It's basically, you don't get a lot in it, but it goes a long way. This one's different. Um, it's a moisturiser, but it's got gritty bits in it. But what it does is it tightens up your skin and it does sort of seem to smooth out wrinkles. I don't know if it's got some of that tightening. I don't know what it is in it. Dragon's blood. <laughs> um, but that one smells really nice. It is slightly different to the one I've bought before, but I'm sure it'll do the same thing. But I've used a couple of these now. So that's that. That's for me. It smells nice and it's nice and moisturising. Right, I've got a couple of pairs of sunglasses. Got a, got a, mix, a mixture of stuff in here, bits and bobs. Let's put it out. Um, so I tried some of the nail stuff yesterday. Um, hello, um, and the eyelash stuff that I bought. So I can tell you that the nail glue did not stick at all. So I'm actually sending that back. It did not stick. Um, the eyelashes, I couldn't get on with any of them. I am just rubbish at putting eyelashes on. So I'll probably give all those to my daughter. And then I did use the gel nail polish, um, which are really pretty colours, but that's already chipped off this morning. I obviously didn't set it properly with the lamp or I don't know what I didn't do, but 
I need to spend more time doing them better than that. But I did use those, so they were okay. But no, as far as the nail glue, no, rubbish. So wasn't impressed with that. Um, let's start with like this. This is a nighty and it was £2.58. Just thought it was quite cute for the summer for me. It's sort of a thin material. It's just a little t-shirt nighty and it's got a frill bottom. It's not adjustable or anything. It's size medium. So I bought that for the summertime. Just thought that was quite cute. Um, and that was, like I said, £2.58. So that's going to go in my drawer. Right, next, um, these are for, <coughs> excuse me, Lola. Her name was Lola. She was a showgirl <coughs> with flowers in her hair. Wow, bows in her hair. Rainbow bow, six of them for 69p. They're all different sort of rainbow. Very, very cute. So they're for Lola. I should put them in her birthday stuff. Um, next, another thing for Lola. 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 My voice is going. Um, this is a little romper suit. Very cute. It's age. Does it say what age it is? It does up underneath. It's sort of cottony here. And then it's ribbed, it's all attached. That's gonna be really cute for the summer. Um, I've got that on there, shorts, sunglasses. <clears throat> Nine to 12 months, and that was £3.50 with 23p off. So that's another little present for her birthday. Her birthday, she's actually one, <clears throat> excuse me. She's one on Thursday, so I shall wrap all her presents up today. This is for Finn. It's a little shorts and t-shirt set. Um, three to four years old, and it was £3.29. That's a three to four year old. He's got lots of short sets now for the summer. They're, they're a bargain and they wash up really good. That's quite not a bad size three to four actually. It's probably a little bit big, but that's another one of his birthday presents. Um, next is this, it comes in a box. Now like I bought this because I got, like I said, something like 60, 70, something, a silly voucher. Um, and I ended up paying nothing for this small order. So if I send it back, I won't get any money back. So there's no point in sending it back. Um, it's actually, a little it's I kind of bought it because I liked it but I don't know whether to give this to Lola it's metal so it's a little mirror set I just thought that was really adorable they did them in different colors but I thought it was quite vintage I don't know whether to keep that or what to do with that because I'm I liked it for me really um vintage mirror I want to say it was £3.28 with 37p off, so just under £3 um, for that set, which is a really nice little gift, actually. There. Right, next. Bit of a different colour. Because all my bags are neutral, I thought I needed to put something extra in this order, and I thought, try this. It was £2.79. Sorry about the rustling. It's wash wipeable so it's like waterproof it's quite basic it's just got a zip and then the straps a little bit basic but um, crossbody bag kind of nice to have a bright one sometimes to go with an outfit I like that it's just different isn't it they had loads of different colors um so i will keep that because it's different but um yeah there's no pocket on the inside the strap is adjustable but it's probably good if you're going somewhere for the day, like a theme park or something, because you could, like I said, cross-body it. Um, and they had loads of colours, but I chose orange just because it was really different. That, I think I did just tell you the price, but I will tell you again. £2.79. So that was good. Um, 
The next thing I have is a box. <laughs> and in this box is one of these. I've got loads of these. I'm going to use them for the wedding to put flowers in. They're actually for makeup brushes and stuff. Um, why have I not got a place written down on there? Is it on a different one? Because like I said, these are all mixed up. Is it on this one? Can't find the price of that one, guys. But it was definitely about a pound. Wouldn't have been more than that. They're normally about two fifty um, ish. But I bought that one, and I'm think it was on, yeah, something like seventy seven p or something like that. Um, sorry, I can't give you the exact price of that. Is this the same? No. So this is another one of those pots, seventy seven p. This is probably the fourth one I've got now. Um, I'm thinking of using these for the wedding for sweets. That's why I've got so many of them for the price of them as well. But I've got the little spoon. Um, but yeah, I, I won't buy any more of them. But I just think you can't go wrong with stuff like that when you're doing a wedding or a party to put sweets in. And So that was that. I'll put it behind me. Um, there's a ring. I think I had to make this order over like a certain amount. I needed to spend a pound or no, spend 30p or something. So this is a size seven, but it was 29p. Hang on, where's the thing? Um, size seven for 29p. Actually looks quite good, doesn't it? I might keep that one on today. So yeah, I had to bring it up and I needed something for 20p. So I found that and thought, okay, that'll do. Um, Right, I don't know if you remember me saying to you I was waiting for a glass teapot, but then when I read the description, I wasn't 100% sure um, what whether I was getting the teapot, and actually I didn't get the teapot. It was, so these were, um, like I said, I've written it down as teapot because that's what I thought I was getting, and I didn't. Um, I paid, bear with me, it's on here, because I just saw it. So this was seven pounds, well, £6.99. Um, and it isn't the teapot, that it was supposed to be a cold, what do you call them, a cold drinks teapot. It's actually, two more of those mugs so I'm going to send them back because I wanted the teapot and two mugs and that clearly isn't so I don't need to keep I've got four of these now I don't need to keep them without the teapot so I kind of changed my mind I'm going to send them back because they've sent me the description was really it showed the teapot so it's only until after I bought it I could see that it said cups but then it still was showing the teapot so they are going to go back because I've got enough mug because I don't, yeah, I only wanted it if I had the actual teapot to go with it. So that's that. Right, next, um, sunglasses. So these sunglasses um, were not those ones. They were 78p. I like them because they're round. 78p they're a bit different to my normal ones always square um and they've actually got i didn't realize but it's a cat on the side so they're quite cool 78p they don't come with a uh what do you call it i can't get the words out today they don't come with a case or anything but 78p they're cool <coughs> excuse me what's it with blair I've got sun shining in on me today and I'm looking a wreck. I wear sun glass, not sunglasses, but glasses for you to cover my eyes so you can't see how disgusting my, like I always have really bad dark, dark circles under my eyes. 
so I cover them up with my glasses and because I can't see. Right, next thing. Now this is for my daughter. Um, I don't know if she'll like it or not. Um, she chose it, but the material is different to what I think she's going to be expecting it to be. So, not sure about that. It's a jumpsuit. She chose grey. <coughs> Got a tickle. It is... Is that real buttons? Button up. It's got pockets, should be pleased with that. And it's just uh, button all the way down. And then it's got a tie waist and it's kind of a thin, not really thin, it's not see-through thin. Um, it's nice, I, hopefully she'll like that and it will fit her how she wants it to and the legs will be long enough. Um, that jumpsuit was, XL um, £13.49 but I did get some pennies off that because I had a voucher so I'll let her try that and see what she thinks of that um, not bad quality considering um, price <coughs> oh this is really annoying me this cough right this is for Lola's birthday the box has got Mickey Mouse on it it is as I've just said Mickey Mouse I've got a feeling this is on this page. Um, excuse me. Some of these things have managed to get by my um, it's like I said, they've all mixed up. This is really, really annoying me because they're all written in order should be very straightforward um can't see it it was about three pounds something guys i know that if you want the actual price just ask me and i will Ooh. it could be that Minnie Mouse. Yeah, it could be that. £3.59. I think it's likely to be that because it's the only thing I've got Disney. But it doesn't stick on the bottom, but it's just a tray, eating plate with a spoon and a fork. Um, how would that come off? Oh, it just literally slides on. I guess that's for washing. It's cute. Um, yeah. That's not a bad little gift. So I love the ends of those. Really cute. If you like Disney, that's a good gift. So that's that. Right, next glasses. More glasses. These ones I'm really not sure about. So they were over five quid. I saw them loads of times, put them in my basket, and it wasn't until I had this voucher to spend, so I had to buy something. So I managed to get them for um Put the glasses back on so I can find them. I think they're on this one. Um, sunglasses, bling. They were four pound four, and then I got one pound thirty-five off them. But they're not how I thought, because I thought the sides were all bling, but they're actually like a plastic brownie colour. They're a bit strange, but the front is very bling. Um, look a bit Elvis-like, don't they? Now when I got them, I'm not keen on them. Now I've got them. They're different, aren't they? But I went to look at sending them back because I don't think I'll wear I'm not sure if I'll wear them because they're a bit out there. And like I said, because I've bought them with this like big money off voucher thing, I would only get um, two pounds back for them. So I'm kind of like decide, undecided whether to keep them because they're actually on there at the moment for about five quid. So kind of like, do I just keep them then and maybe wear them? once or just have them on my dressing table but I've got lots of sunglasses and there's another pair here actually as well so I'm I'm not sure I'm waffling on I might send them back I don't know they're different they're, I don't think they're me another pair came with a squashed box these are really cool now these sunglasses are square sunglasses 
I've put them down as um, 77p and I like these ones because I like the gold on the side but they're very square they're cool 77p I'm keeping these ones do you see what I'm saying when you can pick something up like that for 77p that might only last the one yeah you know, the one summer but um and then those other ones being nearly a fiver although I got money off I prefer these I think they're more wearable so but the sunglasses are just a bit teeny you can't go wrong with you really can't and they're fun so right I've got three more of these You've seen these before, 77p um, storage boxes, just really pretty. You can put them on shelves because they're slightly sparkly. They're very good. What's this? Oh, I'm not going to get this out of the packet. This is a present for somebody. Um, but it's a Lego Build a Sunflower. I've got that. I think that's going to be for my mum, but don't tell her. Um, and that was £1.88. So not cheap for Timu, but they look really cute when they're built. And the sunflower represents my granddad, because my mum's dad, granddad uh, Griggs, granddad Donald, he, when he died, we put sunflowers on his grave. So whenever we have sunflowers now, we always think of my granddad, granddad Griggs, granddad Donald, which is my mum's dad. A beautiful, beautiful, beautiful human being. So sunflowers, very special. So that's a nice gift for my mama, for my gorgeous mummy. Um, right, let's go next. I've done those. Okay. Right, so this is just this last bit now. So first, not impressed with this. It's a little hat birthday hat you've got to build it yourself um doesn't look anything like the picture did and this little hat oh i know where these pages let's find it i think it's here um this little hat is for finn for his birthday because i've got lola loads of things to put on her head but not him and um 84p i know it's only 84p but it's I mean, I'll keep it, but it's not that impressive, really. Next, um, my daughter for the birthday party, this is mainly birthday party stuff, is making cake pops. She's brilliant at them and comes with instructions. But basically this, it's got loads of bits in it. I'm not going to build it. I'm going to let her build it. It's got a screwdriver in there as well, but it's a cake pop stand. So when you've got the cake pops and you need to stand them up it builds like that and then they stand in there um she wanted one of those um, and that was cake pop stand I'm looking for it it will be on there £2.36 so she'll be excited to get that next is a pack of these these are um, I'll show you I, I won't put it together properly but so you get four in there by the looks of it or five five is it yeah five these ones 99p and there's five of them and I bought we bought them in these are for the party Oh, they're all why do they do that with things like this you know when you you don't want to be spending hours doing this do you pulling this all is that supposed to even come off i'm presuming it is mm, i'm not convinced that these are going to be any good what is that there's no sticky pack or anything on them Right, bear with, because that's not very impressive if that's the case. Maybe I shouldn't have just taken that off. You get a bit of string and then this. 
I thought they'd have like sticky tab on them. Anyone know what you're supposed to do with those? But I'm not. I thought they'd be like sticky tab. Um, glad I got these out to see it actually. Maybe that wasn't supposed to come off. Maybe you're supposed to tie. I need to look at the instructions. But maybe you're supposed to. Because I thought, listen to me waffling on, that they would have a sticky thing and then you would do kind of that. But I've got a feeling you tie that round it and then you just pull these all out. Like, because they're supposed to basically look like, in the picture they look like pom-poms. Or maybe you do. Maybe you just pull them. I'd have to get my... my daughter to look at these I don't I don't want to ruin it it's a flower basically but that I can't see how it works I really can't see how that works maybe you just have to pull out the layers and make them that's going to take ages and be really annoying don't know about that then I'm going to leave those aside and try and look at the instructions I've got those in another colour as well <coughs> I'll do something with them, but no, I'm not that impressed with that. Right. Like I said, this is all party stuff. We've bought two of the turquoise green tablecloths, which are 137 centimetres by 183. These tablecloths were um, £1.7, and then we got two purple ones the same price because the part is we're gonna have lots of tables so they're like pvc i'm gonna try and take them off and keep them because i threw all the ones away when i did my elvis party and it's such a race we reuse them we've got two pastel ones with donuts on as well these were a little bit more money i think they're the same they may be the same doesn't say how big they are i think they were the same kind of size though these were £1.59 each, so a little bit more expensive, but we just wanted to go for lots of pastel colours. Hence why we also bought some rainbow drink cups. 25 of those for £2.79. A whole bag. This is going to annoy the heck out of all of us with the kids with these. Party blowers. Should we try one? Oh, that's not so bad. They're not really loud. Some of them a bit loud than others. Um, but a pack of those. You can never have a party without those. 50 of them for £1.28. That's good. Next, this little hat. So this is absolutely tiny. Ridiculously. It's got elastic on it. And it's for age three. It's going to look really silly. Um, so yeah, that was a bit of a waste of money as well. That one was £1.11. Next, it's a bag of these. I'm going to open them because now that I've seen those other things, I'm not impressed with what I'm going to have to do to try and make them look good. Um, these are, how many did you get? Oh, and something's just fallen out on the floor. Hang on one minute. Don't want to lose them. These are the things that you have to thread through to hang them. You get colour-wise, does it say what, how many? Six piece. These are 52p. I should have got more of these because once you um, pull it, they're all stuck. Oh, really? I'm going to have to pull all of that down. I'm not going to do it now. But you'll get the drift. It will hang. They hang. Um, not going to pull them now because they're easy to keep in the pack like that. But we've got all the different colours. They're quite good. They're going to be annoying to have to pull all that down. And then the tag things that hold them up. Just go through them. Yeah. So, not bad. We're allowing a couple of hours to, to, you know, to set the party up. So, we'll have time to sort out what we're going to do about those flowers still looking at them now you know they were like tissue pom-poms 
I think I was supposed to keep that on it around the middle and then I'm going to look at the instructions and then pull them all out and they look like pom-poms we'll, we'll give it a go I'll take some pictures and insert them <coughs> uh, I won't upload this one until I yeah what I'll do is I'll take those pictures of our decorations that we've done them and then I'll upload that video after so you get to see how they all looked in the end put that ribbon back in there so we don't really use it yeah the party's in a couple of weeks so this video probably won't come out until until I've done that not much more left I'll pack up the, these ribbons because they are just really good for tying on balloons um Ten roll of ribbon. Let me find that. Ninety nine p. So we'll tie all the balloons to those for the kids. Next is there's the blue one. Next is popcorn. So we're going to do popcorn and sweets. So the pink popcorn one is six. Um, and that's £1.34 and the blue one has got 12 pieces and that was £2.23 so we're going to fill it with crisps or popcorn or something save the kids keep putting their hands in and they'll have their own but they're quite nice and then the last I've got two more things in here get these ones out and have a look shall we these are ice creams um, donut no Popcorn, birthday hat, four piece ice cream, £1.91. Decorations. Can't find the end. Okay. Sorry. Right, let's see if these are any easier. Right. There's paper clips. Mm, okay. So that means we need to use a paper clip. Let's do one of them. The good thing is the string's already on these. The other good thing is they have sticky on them, which is what I thought those other ones would be. And then you stick them. These are cute. Now this is more like it. You stick them and then you've got a paper clip as well. I mean, I don't think we'd, you'd need to put the paper clip on once you've stuck them, but See, that's more like it, isn't it? Once that's stuck, that will look better. Got different colours, four of them. And I think for the price, that is really good. Um, should have got more of these. And then you can take them apart. So I won't stick them because I will reuse them. So I will leave, the that's probably why they put the paper clips in. So you, you could just use paper clips and not stick them. And then you get to reuse them. I thought that's what those other flowers were gonna be like. Um, they are good. They are cool and £1.91's not bad for that. They're very cute. So let's put those back, put them back in the thing. Yeah, I I thought that's what those other things were. But that is all the party stuff, apart from this one thing I'm gonna show you now, I'm gonna have a little go of it, just because it looks fun. Another thing we thought to put on the tables is a, what is this called? Magic Scratch. It was £1.77. Can I open it up and have a little look? Hopefully it's got... I can't get it out of the packet. Let's open it. So it comes like this. And in it, that's disappointing. You've only got one... Oh, you've only got two scratch pens I thought there was going to be loads and loads of them um but what you have got is some stencils and instructions and let's do one so the idea is I'm going to do one now I bought these for the kids to have a play around with so you can write you scratch oh they're good you can scratch on them 
but I wanted there to be more pens than that. But they are they're quite good. That's not bad, is it? Um, like I said, it's a shame there's not more pencils in it, that's all. But you get a lot of those in there. It, it's fun for anyone, actually, and it's really good for a party. I'm going to get a few more packs of those and put them away for Christmas. So 100. And the stencils are there. That's really cute for a party. So that's something different. Finished on a good note there, like that. I, I just thought there was lots and lots of pens in there as well. All you need is um, like a little cocktail stick, really. So I'll get some cocktail sticks and put them with it. And then everyone can draw. That's it, really. Some good stuff, isn't there? I think that's everything. Um, like I said, I don't think I'll upload this one yet. I might wait till I actually have the party. And then we can um, do that. But I can now put all this stuff away. Yay. <laughs> Um, so yeah, I don't know when you'll be seeing this video. I might put it up without the party on and do a separate party video, or I might put it up with, with the party bit on it. We'll see. Anyway, that's it for now. Um, I've got some of my nice necklaces on. Nails done. I'm going get, to get on with the rest of my day. Um, yeah, some really good little bits again. You cannot go wrong with Timu. We're just loving it. Um, there surely is nothing else for me to buy anymore. There's always something to buy. Always something to buy. Um, yeah, like, subscribe, comment, share. Help me get this channel, you know, out there and people watching it. Um, it helps my mental health. Um, I enjoy doing it. But I really want to talk to you guys, so comment back. That's it, really. You know what I'm going to say to you guys. Have a good day. Ta-ta for now. Bye.